Let's begin with a word of prayer and we'll move right along into today's lesson. We thank you, Lord, for this time we have to learn and grow. We seek to do the best we can and add to what we know. We love you, God, with all our hearts and to others' love we show. Pleasing you is our goal, not to our lesson we should go. In Jesus' name, amen. I believe in Jesus Christ, the Messiah who died and was resurrected from the dead to save humanity from sins. He is my Lord, Master, Boss, and Savior. I love God. I love myself. And I love others with the God kind of love. I believe the Bible is inspired by the Spirit of God and is the basis for morality, rights, and wrongs. I look to the Spirit of God to understand God's intent behind every letter of the Bible. I abide by this intent, and I live to honor God in thought, in word, and in deed. I believe there is a heaven to gain and a hell to shun. Father, please give me grace and mercy to please you more. This is my morality creed. In the name of Jesus, amen. Hi, welcome to Here's Friend Homeschool Academy with Ms. Nita. In this lesson, Lesson 6 and I, we're going to talk about the multiplication facts for times four. If you have your workbook out, you can turn to page 58, where the multiplication chart is to refer to as you complete the contents on page 59, where we are today. As we go through our uh, multiplication problems, we're going to answer each one. Feel free to refer to your multiplication table on page 58 if you don't know these, okay? Feel free to do it. I just want you to get comfortable with these uh, multiplication facts because you want to commit them to memory. Four times zero is zero. Once again, if you do not know the answer, just look at the multiplication table and commit it to memory. Today, we're just talking about times four. Four times one is four. Four times two is eight. Four times three is 12. Four times four is 16. Four times five is 20. Four times six is 24. Four times seven is 28. Four times eight is 32. Four times nine is 36. Four times 10 is 40. Good job. Did you get that? Let's try one more time. Four times zero is zero. Anything times zero is always going to be zero. One times zero is zero. Five times zero is zero. Twenty times zero is zero. One million times zero is zero. Four times zero is zero. Four times one is four. Four times two is eight. Say it aloud with me so you can hear yourself saying it and commit it to memory. Four times two is eight. Four times three is 12. Four times four is 16. Four times five is 20. Four times six is 24. Four times seven is 28. Four times nine, four times eight is 32. Four times nine is 36. And four times 10 is 40. Make sure that before you end this lesson, you're able to recite the fours ten, uh, times table exactly as you heard me do it. Feel free to just repeat this video as often as you need to, or just sit down, turn off the television, turn off the music, and recite this over and over and over again until you learn four times zero up to four times 10. Boys and girls, that's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for coming to class, being a part of today's lesson. But until next time, remember Jesus loves you and so do we. God bless. I'll be your hero's body and as you study with heroes born. You.